Orange Storm Giga. With a build volume of 800mm x 800mm x 1000mm, the industrial-grade FDM printer not only meets the user's printing needs for oversized models, but also reduces the need to cut models into smaller sections for efficient printing. The heated bed consists of four independent, 410 by 410 mm PI magnetic high temperature platforms with a maximum temperature of 90 degrees Celsius. The four platforms can be heated simultaneously to reach 90 degrees Celsius over the entire area in 17 minutes, ambient temperature, 25 degrees Celsius. The platform where the model is located can also be automatically recognized and heated independently, or manually and independently controlled for increased energy efficiency. Utilizing a 64-bit 1.5G clock speed quad-core high-performance processor, SOC RK3328, it provides sufficient computing capacity while delivering six times the printing speed, with a max. BioLeg BioLeg is a groundbreaking prosthetic knee joint, which can help improve the daily activities of limb loss in transfemoral patients. We have done several trial fittings in my New York facility with very good results, says Gary Morano, CPO, LPO, and CEO of OTF Prosthetics and Orthotics in New York. BioLeg allows a more natural gait to walk long distances more efficiently along with stability using ramps and inclines. Another functional benefit is to provide an easier sit-to-stand feature giving the user a quicker and smoother transition when standing up from a chair. BioLeg features include BioLeg assists a wide range of movements with power, such as ascending and descending stairs and sitting on and standing up from a chair. BioLeg bends the knees with power and actualizes graceful walking without stumbling, even when walking slowly or in small steps, by using power to bend the knees and lift the toes from the ground during the swing phase. Bio Frame VR Shoes Freem has raised $316,700 pounds, in funding to launch its VR shoes, or shoes that you can wear in virtual reality games and applications. The startup is focused on designing wearable tech for virtual reality. The round was led by Nikolaus Oldendorf through the Oldendorf family office, part of a global shipping and maritime firm based in Germany. Freem's new pre-seed round will support the immediate launch of a developer version of the company's flagship VR shoes and enable the startup to scale production for a full, consumer-level release in 2025. Freem CEO Ashley Foxcroft said in an interview with GamesBeat that he believes we're at a key moment for virtual reality. Its market value related to gaming is projected to grow from $16.86 billion in 2024 to $105.22 billion by 2032. Despite this, attempts to improve the physical motion aspect of virtual reality have stalled. VR Screen Dress Dutch designer Anouk Wipricht explores the intersection of fashion and technology. She devised a spider dress that protects the wearer's personal space and a cage dress that discharges 1 million volts of electricity. Now, she created a 3D, printed dress with wearable eyeballs that move depending on the brain activity, unveiled during the Ars Electronica Festival which runs between September 6 and 11, 2023 in Linz, Austria. The mind-controlled digital eyes measure the cognitive load and activity of the wearer in real time, showing them how much stimulus their brain receives at the moment. The 3D, printed dress with moving eyes aims to show the direct correlations between the wearer's actions and how their brain reacts to the series of movements they make. The mind-controlled 3D, printed dress named Screen Dress functions through a brain-computer interface. The chipsets inside each eyeball, engineered with medical engineering GmbH, are connected to the electroencephalogram sensor. Shotover Jet Get ready for the ride of a lifetime as you embark on the Shotover Jet Boat Ride. Brace yourself for high-speed thrills as you zip from one jetty to another, experiencing adrenaline-pumping twists, turns, and spins along the way. Feel the rush as the jet boat speeds up to 90 km per hour on the icy blue waters of the Shotover River, offering a unique and exhilarating way to explore the stunning rivers and canyons in the area. Don't forget to pack warm clothes and waterproofs to stay comfortable during your action-packed adventure. And to make your experience even more convenient, a complimentary shuttle service is available to transport you from the station building in Queenstown to the jet boat departure point. 
So buckle up and get ready for a wild ride, filled with non-stop excitement from start to finish. During this 30-minute jet boat ride, you'll travel at speeds of up to 85 kilometers per hour along the Shatova River. Loon LLC was an Alphabet Incorporated subsidiary working on providing internet access to rural and remote areas. The company used high-altitude balloons in the stratosphere at an altitude of 18 kilometers, 11 miles, to 25 kilometers, 16 miles, to create an aerial wireless network with up to 1 megabit per second speeds. 1, 2, 3, if for a reference to the balloons used, 1. Project Loon began as a research and development project by X, formerly Google X, in 2011, but later spun out into a separate company in July 2018. 5. In January 2021, it was announced that the company would be shut down due to lack of profitability. The balloons were maneuvered by adjusting their altitude in the stratosphere to float to a wind layer with the desired speed and direction, using wind data from the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration NOAA. Users of the service connected to the balloon network using a special internet antenna attached to their building. The signal traveled through the balloon network from Polyconnect's Holobox. At the recently concluded Consumer Electronics Show, CES, 2024, Holoconnects, a pioneer in AI-powered holographic solutions, made a significant mark with its showcase of advanced hologram technology. The company unveiled its latest products, the Holobox and Holobox Mini, demonstrating the potential of immersive holographic experiences across various industries. Holoconnects has earned acclaim for its cutting-edge technology, with endorsements from major organizations and companies such as UNICEF, the United Nations, Nike, and BMW. The versatility of its holographic solutions is evident in their application across multiple sectors, including sustainability, healthcare, education, and entertainment. The CES 2024 exhibition offered a comprehensive look at how these technologies are transforming communication and engagement strategies. At CES 2024, Holoconnects presented an array of products designed to captivate and engage. REM If you sometimes want an electric boost while skateboarding, but don't want an electric skateboard, then you might like REM. It's essentially a handheld power stick that works completely independent of the user's board. Currently the subject of a Kickstarter campaign, REM is being developed by Barcelona-based startup Limitless Propulsions. CEO founder Marc Esbarb Valhonrat first got the idea when he spotted a longboarder using a rubber-tipped wooden pole to push themselves along, sort of like a land-going stand-up paddleboarder. REM is likewise a stick of sorts, although it takes the form of a carbon fiber shaft with a throttle at the top and an aluminum-framed single-wheel propulsion unit at the bottom. Twisting the knob-shaped throttle activates the unit's 3000W brushless motor, which spins up the wide polyurethane will via a belt drive mechanism. The setup has a top speed of 40 km per hour 25 miles per hour along with a complete lack of brakes, the onus is upon users to stop themselves as they normally would.